write down all the factors of 910 to write all the factors first we should do the prime factorization of it so let us do that is 910 For this number, last digit zero, so we take five here. First number nine. A number close to nine in five table is five one five. Nine minus five four four carried forward, making it forty one. A number close to forty one in five table is five eight forty. Forty one minus forty one one carried forward, making it ten. When do we get ten in five table? Five two is ten. Now for this number, last digit two e one, so we take two here. First number one smaller than two, so we take two numbers. That is eighteen. When do we get eighteen in two table? Two nines eighteen. The other number two. When do we get two in two table? Two ones two. Now for this number, last digit one not e one, so this number not divisible by two. Next to prime number three. To check divisibility by three, for that we should add the digits. That is nine plus one, ten. Is ten divisible by three? No. So this number also not divisible by three. Next to prime number five. Here the last digit is neither zero nor five, so this number is not divisible by five. Next to prime number seven. Let us check divisibility by seven in this way. Ninety-one by seven. Here we have nine. A number close to nine in seven table is seven one seven. Nine minus seven two two carried forward, making it twenty one. When do we get twenty one in seven table? Seven three is twenty one. Over here, no number has been left. That means this number is divisible by seven. So we write seven here. And here we write this number that is thirteen. Now we have thirteen. Thirteen is a prime number, so thirteen ones thirteen. Now nine one zero is equal to the product of these numbers. Okay, product of these numbers that is five into two into seven into thirteen. Now. Let us write down all the factors of it. Any number you take, that number will definitely include one and the number itself in its factors. I repeat, any number you take, that will definitely include one and the number itself in its factors. Next. Now, from these numbers, you select one different number at a time. Like that, how many numbers do we get? We get five, two, seven, and thirteen. That's it. Next. Now, from these numbers, you select a combination of two numbers. How do we do that? See. First, you fix five. Combine with two. Five into two, ten. Now combine with seven. Five into seven, thirty-five. Now combine with thirteen. Five into thirteen, sixty-five. Now you leave five. Fix two. Combine with seven. Two into seven, fourteen. Now combine with thirteen. Two into thirteen, twenty-six. Now you leave to fix seven combined with thirteen. Seven into thirteen ninety one. No other combination possible. Next, now you take the combination of three numbers. How do we do that? See. First, I fix these two numbers. Five into two ten combine with seven ten into seven seventy. Now combine with thirteen ten into thirteen one thirty. Okay. Now I take five along with seven and thirteen. Five into seven thirty five thirty five into thirteen. 
थर्टीन फाइव सिक्सटी फाइव थर्टीन थ्री थर्टी नाइन प्लस सिक्स फोर्टी फाइव वी गेट फोर फिफ्टी फाइव नाव यू लीव फाइव टेक दीज थ्री नंबर्स टू इंटू सेवन फोर्टीन फोर्टीन इंटू थर्टीन थर्टीन फोर फिफ्टी टू थर्टीन वन थर्टीन वी गेट वन एटी टू ओके नो अदर कॉम्बिनेशन पॉसिबल नेक्स्ट नाव यू टेक द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ फोर नंबर्स हाउ डू वी डू दैट सी over here we have only four numbers when we take all the four numbers we get 910 itself therefore these all numbers are the factors of 910 these numbers are the factors of 910 am i clear <coughs> 